Hello guys and welcome back. In the last video we got the ball rolling with uh, connecting to the MySQL server using command from. Uh, we did everything fine but uh, I don't like the way to connect to the MySQL server. We just did in the last video. I mean uh, it was tedious, uh, it was uh, you know it was weird. I hope you guys understand what I'm talking about. So let's uh, go ahead and make this uh, be any better, any beautiful. Alright then let's learn how to set environment variable for MySQL server. Let's open command prompt and type MySQL. Let's open command prompt. And just type MySQL. Well we are unable to open MySQL. No problem, let's make it work. Now let's have a look where we have installed MySQL server in a C drive and program files and then type MySQL. Okay, there you go. Alright, and then you have to copy this one. Uh, as you can see here we have MySQL.exe file here. So we need to specify this path in our system environment variable. So let's close that. And now let's go to control panel. And then find system. Everyone system settings. Click on environment variables. And then edit. And uh, add same column and paste the part you just copy paste and okay and then okay okay and just scroll that now, now time my scroll again okay actually we need to restart command prompt so just close that and open it again sorry command prompt And just type MySQL. Well, we did it, but uh, we need to enter username and a password for connecting to, uh, you know, to connect to MySQL server. And just uh, type MySQL. And then the hostname we just did in the last video. Point two, point two, point one. Then user root, sorry. Then user root. And then the password. Password is password. You might have different password. And then enter. Okay. B so. Okay, so from now on we will be able to open my school server directly. We don't need to just open C drive and copying, pasting files. You know, it's a like a you know, you know, it's boring stuff. So thank you for watching this video, guys. From the next video, we will learn some queries in SQL and we will learn how to create databases, how to delete databases, how to create tables, and so on. Thank you. See you next video.